And we're back. And once again, by my side, my co-host for so many years, uh, in July is our 19th anniversary. Wow. Not our 19th no, anniversary. But, but <laughs> that's almost a score. Almost. That's a, a lot. And some. Yeah. 19 years, and then the following uh, year, it'll be our 20th anniversary. That would make sense, the following year. Yeah. That would be. Got it. Thank you. I just figured that out. <laughs> <laughs> Bill Bancroft is here, Major Domo, uh, head honcho at Patrol One Security, the best security company in all of Southern California. Do you serve only Orange County? Uh, right now, we're spreading from Orange County into Riverside, San Bernardino, and parts of L.A. County, and the next step is going to be San Diego. We've had boy, so oh many boy. requests for service in those areas, we just can't hold back any longer. So, Being on, being on the Wally George show has, has, has just... Uh, burgeoned. Caused burgeoned. us to burgeon, whatever that means. Skyrocketed uh, yeah. Patrol 1 into a not only number one, but beyond num number one, if that's possible. <laughs> well, it, it, is really, it really has made a difference for us, and right now, not only are we servicing a lot more customers and clients, but we're also looking for a lot more employees are, that are of high caliber and want to be in the security industry, which is probably one of the fastest growing industries in the United States. Okay, so they could... So they can they call, call and you. talk to me and go to work and get rich. 714-541-0999. Tell the people out there who might be considering advertising on the Wally George Show what a great thing it is. I think that would be me, because I'm always advertising with Wally no, George. No, I mean, I mean, what about people who are who are who are watching us? Oh, saying, why should they advertise with yes, the Wally? Why should they? They should advertise with the Wally George Show because it will put your company on the map, like it has mine. Before we were just itsy bitsy little guys. <laughs> now we're big, all because of Wally. So there you go. You can contact me, and I can make you a giant, too. <laughs> That's right. Now we're legends in our own minds. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> no, the truth is, advertising on the Wally George Show does pay off, and that's the truth, Wally. I, I, uh, <clears throat> I have an attorney who wrote to me and said, I, had, I hesitated going on your show because of the bombasticness of it, but he, he's been with me now for eight years, and his name is Eric Trout. Mm -hmm. and, and he does uh, 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 personal injuries and so forth, and, and said it has been unbelievable the amount of new cases that if he's uh, gotten. Uh, new clients. You know who show. really should advertise with you because I know this guy is looking to move up in the world since he just moved down big time. Bill Clinton. And that's Bill Clinton. <laughs> yeah. and we talk about him all the time. He had to get on here and do some advertising. I think it'd help his career. Hey, let me see Bill Bill Clinton's picture there. There, Jeff, have you got it there somewhere? Uh, uh, it's coming. <laughs> it's coming. <laughs> okay, here it comes. Bill Clinton, my my new sponsor. Hi, this is this is Bill Clinton. Please, please hire me for anything. I'll do anything for any amount of money. I I need money bad. Hey, uh, and I got to support my new offices here in Harlem. Uh, yeah, right. You know, <laughs> speaking speaking of Harlem, what really kills me is when. All of this hoopla happened w when he was going to uh, rent this whole floor, not only a, a suite, but a whole floor, the penthouse, the whole penthouse in, in downtown plush New York. Right. Uh, and everybody just went into orbit uh, when they, they found out the rent was almost $800 million a year. Then, then all of a sudden... 800 million or 800,000? 800,000. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, knowing Bill Clinton, it could have been 800 million. 800,000 a year. Uh-huh. When I, the other ex-presidents spent 200,000. Okay. So, uh, I'm glad you corrected me on that. <laughs> I, I would have got an email. <laughs> but, uh, but when they turn him down on the 800,000 a year, uh, then he decides... I belong in Harlem. <laughs> I always, I always wanted to have my offices in in Harlem. Why didn't he go there in the first place? I don't know. He just got distracted by some realtor who says, "Oh no, you should be down here in Manhattan." No, 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 no. I really want to go to Harlem. I, so then he he <laughs> drove up there in front of his new office building, and he got out and they, they cheered him and we love you, Bill, and everything. And he said, "This is where I belong. This is where I always should have been." Then why didn't you go there in the first place, Bill? Absolutely. Such a such a. And he thinks we're going to believe that. Well, 
He's lied about everything else. So. I know. He, he needs another spin doctor. Unbelievable. Yeah. Now, of course, he wants to build his, his Clinton Library. And I wouldn't be at all surprised if the Clinton Library is filled with every issue of Playboy that you can get your hands on. See, that's what he should have read it, was the Playboy Mansion. That's probably what he needed. Yeah, he should probably move his Clinton Library into the uh, Playboy it's Mansion. Huge, 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 huge Hefners. <laughs> huge Hefners. <laughs> How did you know that about that? <laughs> it must Hugh, have been in a magazine. Hugh Hefner that. would be very happy to give some of his, his, his land at the Playboy Mansion to yeah. Bill Clinton. That's right. And then Clinton could hire... Uh, different playmates as, yeah. uh, as his employees. Yeah, uh, this could work out really well. At taxpayers' expense. We should we should call and tell him this. Yeah. He's well, now, when he moved into Harlem, uh, was Jesse Jackson there to welcome oh, him? Oh, Jesse. The Reverend Jackson. What was so amazing about this, Bill, is when uh, Slick Willie was having all of these problems about... Uh, the morality thing, you yeah, know, yeah. and uh, um, being impeached and, mm -hmm. and all that. The Reverend Clinton came and counseled Bill about straightening out his life. And I remember that, yeah. And a decent morning, and, and he could be okay. The Reverend Clinton, I mean, the, the, Reverend, the, the Jackson. Reverend Jackson, mm -hmm. uh, he, he was counseling him. And the whole time that he was counseling him, he was the father of an illegitimate child to his mistress. Jesse was? Oh, you, did you know this? No. Oh, where have you been? In a cave somewhere, I guess. I didn't know that. He has had a mistress for the past, oh gosh, 10 years. Uh-huh. And he's, he's, he's the father, I think, of a three-year-old daughter. Oh my goodness, and he's counseling Slick Willie? He's counseling Slick Willie on morality. Boy, oh boy. I could see him counseling him on some things, but not morality. I mean, you know, that doesn't fit. Well, when it all came out, and uh, uh, he admitted it, and, yeah. and the girl, uh, his mistress, admitted that this was indeed... Uh, his child. His, his child. You know, he, he's the head of, of the Rainbow Coalition. Uh-huh, yeah, I do know that. Well, she was working for the Rainbow Coalition. Oh. And uh, she, she took... Uh, she thought maybe she should leave under the <laughs> circumstances. So she took some severance pay. Oh, really? Do you know four, how much? 400000 Wow. And then uh, uh, she said she needed some moving expenses to move into a new house in a new location. Uh -huh. So the Rainbow Coalition gave her $85,000 uh, in moving expenses. Oh, my. Do you know anybody who has ever spent $85,000 to move? Uh, not unless it was the Clintons. <laughs> <laughs> no, His I don't. This whole thing is getting... That's out of control. Out of control. The, Rev the Reverend Jackson, I think, uh, his credibility ha has been ruined oh, forever. Not that it was ever good, but it's well, reached new low levels. Time is gone. Thank you, Bill. Hey, thank you, Wally. And I'll be right back. Stay where you are. With some, I'll be back with some final rules. Don't forget, Patrol 1 Security. And tell Bill Wally Sension you get a special discount on your fee. I'll be right back.